Hello and welcome to Harv Mania. My name is Harvey and this is episode number two of my series Task Mania. Now this series is inspired by the real TV series Task Master, so go and check it out. So, for those of you that don't know, I have six contestants competing against each other performing certain tasks that I give them. Now this series is going to have five episodes and whoever wins at the very end of the series will win a big prize. And I still don't know what that's going to be. However, whoever wins this episode will win a fabulous parrot cup. Now then, let's meet our contestants. We've got Josh, Ray, Kyra, Tracy, Richard and Darren. Now, sadly, Josh was not available for recording when I was, so someone has stepped in and done the tasks for him, and that person is... Charlene! So all of the points that Charlene collects will be added onto Josh's score, but if she wins the episode, then Charlene will receive the prize, which is fair enough. Now, before we move on, I need to announce the votes for the castle in the last episode. So, unfortunately for Tracy, she has no votes. Darren somehow had two votes. Ray and Kyra both had four votes each. Richard had seven votes. And then Josh won the task with 19 votes altogether. <laughs> so, that means that Josh was the winner of last episode, as he had the most points. This also means, Josh, that you get your blizzard bubbles. Now anyways, that's enough rambling on from me. Let's get straight on to task number one. Oh my god. Open one. Hello. Hello Charlene, replacing Josh? Yes I am, so I hope I win for him. <gasps> That looks like Edwina to me. Hidden in this workshop are five of these teddies. Find them all. The fastest person who finds all five wins. Your time starts now. One. That's not one of them. That's an example. So then, that's task number one. So let's firstly see how Ray, Kyra and Richard did. So in this workshop's only. Mm -hmm. In here and in there. How long do we have? the fastest time you can do it. This is intriguing. Yeah. Is it anywhere in here? One. One. I found one! How many minutes am I on now? Like seven hours? And you found four. Clear, Barbie. Yep. Hey! hey. <gasps> and oh, you four. found them all. Oh my god. Found them! Five teddies. Well done. Thank you. Thank you, Richard. Do you think you've won? No, that was horrendous. <laughs> Thank you, Pop. <laughs> <laughs> well, didn't that look very fun, eh? Let's just move straight on and see how Darren, Tracy and Charlene did. We start over here, I think. If I see a big spider, I'm gonna scream. Yeah. One. Two. Am I hot or cold? Two, yes, we're doing good. Okay. 
Stopped. Well done, Charlene. Do you think you've done well for Josh? Kind of. Sorry, Josh. Found all five. Sorry. Well done. Excellent. Well done. No one's going to beat that. You reckon? I reckon that's the top one. Okay. Might have gone a bit slow. Oh, well done. Thank you. Well, didn't that look fun? Now let's announce how long it took to find all the teddies. Now it took Ray 20 minutes and 20 seconds to find all five teddies, which puts him in last place. In fifth place with 15 minutes and 45 seconds was Kyra. In fourth place with seven minutes and 23 seconds is Richard. In third place with four minutes and 27 seconds was Charlene. In second place with four minutes and 10 seconds was Tracy, and now that means in first place, with three minutes and nine seconds, was Darren. <laughs> so basically it took Ray 17 minutes and 11 seconds longer than Darren. Anyways, let's just move straight on into task number two. Hello Darren. Hello. <laughs> Oh dear. Reach and touch the big gate at the end of the lane. The floor past the caution tape cannot be stepped on. The fastest person to touch the gate wins. Your time starts now. So I've got to get to that gate there, but I can't touch there. No. Well then, isn't that exciting once again? Firstly, let's see what Richard, Kyra and Charlene did. The time's already started, so... So, am I doing the right thing? Do whatever you want. You're not going to be able to do that. Has it got to be that side or can it be any side of the game? No. <laughs> Well done. I feel like I do well. Yay! Thank you, Richard. Pleasure. Well done. Thanks, Charlene. You're welcome. So all of them went for the kind of the same idea, just throw some bricks down, let's step across, there we go. Let's have a look at Tracy and Darren's attempt. Mm. Oh, <laughs> you are disqualified because you touched the floor. Damn. Stopped. 
you travelled all that way just using two bricks. Yep. Well done. Ah, oh, poor Tracy. Now finally we've got one more contestant to go, so let's see what Ray did. That's impossible. Maybe we'll get past that. Am I allowed to walk here? Yeah. Excuse me. Your time has stopped. Well done. Thank you. Thanks, Ray. Common sense. Ray was the only one who approached the gate from the other side. So anyways, it's time to announce the times. So in last place, who got disqualified was Tracy. In fifth place with five minutes and two seconds is actually Darren. In fourth place with four minutes and 50 seconds was Kyra. In third place with 2 minutes and 37 seconds was Charlene. In second place with 2 minutes and 21 seconds was Richard. So that means in first place with 2 minutes and 3 seconds was Ray. <laughs> so well done Ray for being the winner of that task. So now we are halfway through the tasks as there is 4 tasks and not 3. So let's just move straight on. Let's just get straight in to task number 3. Hello Richard. Hello. Go on, half. Hello Darren. Dan. Do you sit down? Yes. I was wondering what we got in store here. Do not flinch. You are going to be blindfolded. If you flinch, you gain a point. The person with the least amount of points at the end of their turn wins. Please now get ready for your turn. Good luck. Come. Do not flinch. That must be quite a hard one. Ah! Did I make you flinch? So anyways, let's just move straight on and see how every contestant did. Thanks, Darren. I don't know what that thing was, but it's stuff. Oh, that's gravy granules. Ew. <laughs> you go now, can I? Yeah. <laughs> okay then, so I'm just gonna move straight on and announce the results. So in last place, with 14 flinches, is Darren. In fifth place, with four flinches, was Kyra. In fourth place, with two flinches, 
with Charlene. In joint second place with only one flinch each was Ray and Tracy. So that means in first place with no flinches at all was Richard. <laughs> so well done Richard, you were the winner of that task. But anyways, it's now time to move on to the fourth and final task of the episode. <laughs> Open. Hello, guys. Hello. Hello. Let's see what we got here. Make the best rap song and then sing it. The best song wins. So you have ten minutes to plan, and then I will record your rap. Your time starts now. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Presents. <laughs> right. What are we gonna do? I don't know. Oh yeah. So they got to sing a rap. The best one who does it gets a pat on the back. Now I wonder what we have today. Let's first up see Kyra and Ray. Ray and Kyra, they like rap. All of the songs, they are crap. This bench here is very cosy. The garden here is always rosy. Harvey's filming, he's so good. But we won't let him join the brotherhood. Our main is number one. And we've never had such good fun. Yeah! Okay then, well wasn't that very fun? Their singing just makes me wanna run. So now let's get another sandwich, cause we need to see Tracy and Rich. Go. Let's go. We're the crew, the crew. who don't, don't give, give a, a poo, poo about, about anything, anything that we, we do. do. We like, like to, to dance, dance and to prance, prance even when we've, we've got, got no pants. To be in our gang, you gotta be true, true. cause we, we don't, don't like people, people with the flu. flu. <laughs> Do it. Well, wasn't that very cool, but they should go back to rap school. We have one more to see, so let's see Darren and Charlene. You're so forever alone. You talk to the line of bad nose. You're always sitting at home. Ain't no one calling your phone. Yo, 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 you're trying to write a poem about Rome. Never use Google Chrome. Take a bath with some foam. Now over to you, dad in the mix. Boom, 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 boom. I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a baller. I wish I was a rabbit in a hat with a bat and a six by four. Boom, boom, boom. Well then, now we've seen everybody's raps. So once again, to stop people from thinking that I'm going to be biased about this decision, I'm passing over the judging to all of you. Now, if you would like to vote for Ray and Kyra, then comment a red heart. If you'd like to vote for Tracy and Richard, then comment a blue heart. And if you'd like to vote for Darren and Charlene, then comment a green heart. The winning pair of that task will be announced next episode. But now it's time to announce the results so far. So in fifth place with seven points, we have Kyra. In fourth place with nine points, we have Darren. In joint third place, with 11 points each is Tracy and Charlene. In second place with 12 points is Ray. So that means in the lead so far with 14 points is Richard. So now finally it's time to announce the points of the contestants overall so far in the series. Tracy and Kyra both have 16 points. Ray has 20 points. Darren has 23 points. Josh has 28 points and Richard has 29. Also, Josh, don't forget to collect your blizzard bubbles. And don't worry, Josh should be back in the next episode. Don't forget to vote for whose rap was the best and thank you for showing me your best interest. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you all hopefully in episode three. Goodbye.